capture of South Sudan's Bo Town by the Sudan People's Liberation Army and UPDF troops left a trail of massive destruction. Bo, the capital of Jongle State, was recaptured on Saturday following the three weeks of intense fighting between forces loyal to President Salva Kiir and rebel fighters aligned with former Vice President Riek Machar. The conflict in the world's youngest nation has brought about a humanitarian crisis that has sent thousands fleeing into neighboring countries. MPs from the East African Legislative Assembly say the fighting has dented South Sudan's chances of joining their regional bloc. As Yala, we join in the call for immediate cessation of hostilities in southern Sudan and for the parties to sit on the table and deliberate on restoration of peace. When our sister country, our neighbor, burns, and we don't choose our neighbors, God places them there. We must, you know, ensure that we support them, we help them at the hour of need. According to the legislators, a verification team was slated to visit Somalia and South Sudan this year to review the economic pillars to ascertain whether they are fit to be admitted into the East African community. The verification team uh, is up for uh, Somalia, uh, but there are some, some uh, problems uh, that we are experiencing and we wait for an opportune time to send the teams in to do the verification. The East African legislators are scheduled to hold their fourth sitting in Kampala tomorrow. Maurice Ochoa, NTV.